Good morning, everybody. Today I'm at Fall City with Fat Country 182, and we're gonna go fly and land on some gravel bars. It's my very first time doing an off airport landing that's not landing on the water on a float plane. So wish me luck. Hope I don't ball it up. I'm a professional seaplane pilot. I have over 1,000 hours flying seaplanes in Florida, Seattle, and Alaska. Today I'm starting my own seaplane business. I sold my house and bought an airplane. Come join me and my ridiculous adventures. My name's Tony. There we and go. This is my Ooh, YouTube channel. Funny. So we're going to go to the gravel bars in Snohomish. Uh, the first one I'm going to show you have small rocks and it's uh, easy to go in. It's clear approach and it has a nice go around. So if you don't like what you see, you just can go around. Uh, this is your first time going off airport, correct? Yeah, this is my very first time off anything off airport. Tell us about your airplane. So it's a 1976 uh, Cessna 172M model. <clears throat> it is a super hot conversion. So it has a 180 horsepower engine, um, has stall fences, gap seals for the flaps. And then I have the bigger tires and the Cleveland brakes so I have the bigger brakes. Oh, okay. Those are good. And yeah. I also have the air glass nose fork. Yeah. And I have the, um, the fancy exhaust. Can't remember the name of oh, it. Oh, okay. Powerful product. Yeah, yeah that's it. Okay. <clears throat> So, how much fuel do you have? I have 38 gallons usable. I'm probably sitting about 30 gallons right now. Okay. Usually it's nice to go lightweight when we go yeah. to these places. I was trying to burn it off. I was running hard. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, this first gravel is pretty long, so we should be fine. Okay. So, let's hope the fog clear and we go. Yeah. Like a pro! Oh man, that was awesome! How do you like it? That was so cool. You did a great job. <laughs> that was amazing. That was just a nice little adrenaline rush. Yeah. And now it's Larry's turn. Coming into land with his beautiful 170, he makes this look easy. Now that we're all warmed up, we decide to hop over to the next sandbar. It's a little shorter, with bigger rocks, and a slightly more difficult approach. Alright guys, that was freaking exhilarating. That was amazing. Definitely some adrenaline pumping there. Alright, here's this bridge coming up. And a wire. I'm going to need to be really, really low over that bridge, but not too low to hit the wire. Okay, I'm landed. I'm going to turn off the motor and film your landing, okay? The rocks are a little bigger here. I'm just going to hug this ridge and I'll drop on in. Start working on some flaps. There we go, coming in nice and nice and low. Alright, so I'm coming in nice and slow. <clears throat> I got full flaps in. I'm actually flying quite flat. This is what I was taught by Amy Hoover in a Mountain Canyon lesson I had with her. Coming in at 60 miles an hour with power. Coming in nice and slow, just holding my altitude. I got about 1700 RPMs, cruising about 60 miles an hour. Ground speed is 60 miles an hour. Zero wind. Looks good to me. Anthony, you're doing pretty good. What do you think of your airplane for this kind of flying? I'm pretty impressed, really. I, uh, I haven't actually used the big, no the big nose fork or the wheels or tires. I'm pretty happy with it. 
Okay, you're doing really good. Let's do have some more gravel bars. Sweet, let's go have some more fun. There's the gravel bar right there off to the left. I'm gonna swing on around and come in nice and low and we'll put her down. All right, Mixer Rich, flaps up. guys that was freaking amazing i uh, did my first three or four uh sandbar lands with backcountry 182 that was fantastic the very first one i gotta say that was a lot of adrenaline i came in put it down pretty much perfect not to toot my own horn but that was awesome right now i'm on like i don't know 15 to 2,000 foot giant long gravel bar so it's almost nothing it's just a giant runway we're uh, we're all done for the day i had a great time and uh, we're going to head on home. I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as I enjoyed making it. Please like and subscribe to make the YouTube algorithm happy. Maybe even leave me a comment. I'm always afraid I'm hitting my tail. How much are your purse we got?